Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Okay. <gasps> Hello. Hey everybody! Tonight I am staying overnight in the most haunted hotel in America. And I am not scared at all. <laughs> okay. Okay, I might be like a tiny bit scared, but let's just go in and get it over with. Oh, it already feels so creepy in there. Do you guys feel that? I feel like I already have the chills. <laughs> this is our room. Okay, apparently this one is supposed to be extra haunted. They said last week there was a couple staying in this room right next door, and they complained because kids were being really, really loud. But the thing is, there were no kids staying in the hotel that night. There were none, which means it's ghosts. It's ghost children. <laughs> okay, let's just, we're gonna go inside and check it out. I'm really scared, guys. I don't want to go in here. <sighs> <sighs> All right, this isn't so bad. Luigi, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> guys, this is so weird. I'm so spooked. I don't know why he's acting like that. Like, that's super, super scary. <laughs> Oh my god, that's gotta be a prank. There's no way that's real. Oh my god. Okay, sorry guys, Nick is calling me. Hold on one second. <sighs> okay. Hey, Bye. Louie, did you see what I had the hotel staff leave you in the cupboard? That was you? Yep, a dead Louie. <laughs> oh my god, that is not funny! Right, listen, listen, listen. Please do not die tonight. And if you do, please do not haunt me. <laughs> Alright, good luck, baby. Alright. Uh, okay. You know what? If I die and become a ghost, I will 100% be haunting you. All right, guys, now I'm gonna take you into the most haunted room in this hotel. But first, I need some ghost hunting gear. Perfect, let's do it. This hotel room is home to the most famous ghost in this hotel, and her name is the Lady in Red. Luckily, I've got a ghost detector that'll beep if there's any spirits in there, so let's go check it out. The story goes like this. There was once a woman staying in this very hotel. A beautiful woman, one that men adored. She would always wear a long red dress and a super expensive pearl necklace. So one day, one Love. of her lovers came to visit her and she revealed to him that she had cheated on him. And so he, in a fit of anger and rage, in this very bed. Side note, do not cheat on me, Nick. They say to this day, you can still hear her screams and cries for help. And even sometimes, you might be able to find one of her pearl necklaces. Ooh. Oh god. Oh god, guys, that's the spirit detector. I think she's in here. We gotta get out of here, like, right now. All right, guys, it's time for my official ghost tour. We've got all the gear. I've got an EMF detector, I've got dousing rods, and I have an expert ghost hunter. Let's go. All right, I have my EMF detector. I'm gonna turn it on. This is meant to be the most haunted place if you walk past this. Hello. Nothing's happening yet. We'll see. Hello. Hey guys. I'm feeling like they're not trying, they don't want to hang out with me right now. I don't think they're here. This is a nice little spot to have dinner. This is not too bad. If I was a ghost, I'd probably hang out here. I don't think there's anyone here. I'm not complaining about it though. I'd rather them not be here. <laughs> All right, I'm moving on, seeing if I can find them somewhere else. No luck. <laughs> so this is the area where the miners were. There was lots of tunnels underneath Tonopah, and they all led to different areas. Now, when the crushing happened of the multiple men that are buried at the cemetery, this is where they were killed, was in this general area. So the hauntings start when people start talking about the miners and they make sure that they come around to kind of hang out with everybody and make sure that they show themselves. The best part is, is once you start talking about the miners or the children is usually when the EMPs start going off. Mm. That's so spooky. Ooh. Super spooky. So apparently years and years and years ago, a woman that worked in the hotel while she was working, she would lock her kids in this fridge to hang out. So, seems like a nice space to live. I can't complain. Guys, I'm exploring the underground part of the mines right now that are underneath the hotel. This is so scary. Apparently, so many people have died down here. Look at that creepy room. 
<gasps> I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm unhappy here and I'm leaving. <laughs> Guys, this is so creepy. Oh my god. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, hon. You can't go in there. You're not supposed to be in there. We oh. gotta go back this way. Sorry. Okay. Oh my god, that was so crazy. But I can't stop thinking about what the heck was in that hallway we're not supposed to go into. You wanna go? No. Okay, you wanna go? Well, okay, guess that means I'm going on my own, but if I'm gonna ghost hunt at night, then I need my night vision goggles on. <laughs> Let's go catch a ghost. Oh, this is so scary, guys. I'm so nervous. Oh my god, did you hear that? Did you hear that? Oh my god, okay, okay. <gasps> okay, oh my god, guys, this feels a little bit dangerous. I'm like really nervous right now. Oh my god, okay, okay, I'm starting to kind of think that maybe I should turn back right now because this right now guys this is crazy oh my god guys this is so insane i can't believe what was that oh my god oh my god hello is somebody there hello oh my god 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 Guys, I'm going to bed. Well, that was the most horrifying experience of my entire life. Guys, I'm so exhausted. I literally didn't sleep at all. But those are the kind of crazy things I do for you guys because I love you all so much. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe and comment down below what kind of crazy place you want me to go to next. Bye. Guys, I finally made it home. That was a long drive. Nick is actually asleep right now, and I thought since I had to do something so scary, he has to have something scary too. So, I'm gonna go flank him and become the grudge. Okay, let's go. It's <laughs> oh, me. So we. So annoying. Wait, what are you wearing? What? I'm not wearing anything. No, the, the necklace. The bag? I don't know. I didn't put this on. Is, is this not yours? No, it's not mine. I don't know. How did it get on me? I don't know. Are you messing with me?